on my DSLR camera because I thought why not you know so yeah if you saw my Sam in the City vlog you'll see that I vlogged on this and I mean it was a pain carrying a big camera around but then I kind of thought you know what it's good quality I'm happy with it and I got some really cool shots with it so I'm just gonna attempt to get used to carrying this around in my bag or something and you know what thinking about it I mean Casey Neistat carries like a huge camera around every day so why not however it does mean that um, on days like this the high quality camera means that you get to see everything when I'm not wearing makeup such as I am today I'm currently just making some coffee because I'm dying I'm kind of saving all my money at the moment for like uni bits because I mean results day is tomorrow uh, I'm terrified but also like um I'm going to need like a whole bunch of stuff to take with me so I'm saving all my money for that so until I can buy a proper vlogging camera I thought why not attempt it on this it doesn't hurt so the plan for today is I need to film the intro talkie clips for today's video which is going up tonight hopefully depending on because it's in collaboration with uh Stadler I might as well tell you because you'll have seen the video by now hopefully um I need to send it to them first and I'm running a little bit behind schedule because there was lighting issues the last few days but yeah that's the plan today and then we've got to go into town we've got to do a couple of things at the bank and I've also got to get some new passport photos taken but I don't even know if I'm actually in shot slash in focus currently but as I know I kind of just <laughs> got bored of holding the camera up if this is actually like a nice okay shot I'm going to be very annoyed at how easy it was just to find an angle for this camera because I swear to god whenever I'm filming a main channel video it is the hardest thing to find the right position for the tripod and the camera but whatever, I'm not bitter I swear. I just wanted to take a moment to say um, like a huge thank you to everyone who has stuck around on this channel. Before I started making vlogs um, this last like couple of weeks, the last time I uploaded a vlog was on the 14th of October 2014, that is crazy. And then the first video I posted was my first vlogmas, it was vlogmas number one. If you if you were subscribed at the time you'll know I kind of made a couple of attempts at doing like vlogmas and things over the last couple of years. Um, but it, I, it, I never did it properly, it didn't really work. So that was up on the 9th of December 2013. Oh my god! The fact is, about four, nearly five thousand of you actually stuck around for that. So thank you. I want to say a huge thank you because that was lovely, and it's made my transition into vlogging much easier because it's always hard to sort of build up a vlogging channel because obviously it doesn't have as much of an audience that are easily accessible because people don't like search for vlogs. That makes sense as much as they do like main channel videos. But yeah, I've had really good responses. Um, my vlog so I hope you guys are enjoying them I'm really loving the whole sort of difference in juxtaposition between my main channel videos and my vlog channel because I love the idea that my main channel video is almost like the art form it's like something I'm, I spend loads of time and loads of editing and really really sort of proud of detail that goes into them whereas I feel like this as much as I'm now starting to vlog on my big main channel camera it is almost just sort of me like there is hardly any editing I only edit out like the long pauses where I have a little moment and I can't work out what I'm going to say and yeah I just love the sort of obviously I'm proud of both but I love sort of how personal this is even though some people might find this quite boring um because I, I have quite a boring life currently um I really enjoy it so yeah that was really long run I can't really do much until my hair dries and I don't really want to blow dry it but I might have to because I'm running out of time I'm going to laugh so hard if all of that wasn't in focus we're just heading out to town now. Um, I need to edit the video when I get back because I didn't get a chance to do it before we left. Just got to do a couple of things. Got to change stuff the bank and pick something up. But then Jake's meeting a friend, so he's ditching me. <laughs> It'll be interesting. Let's do this. <laughs> just walking home now um i've lost jake he has got to be his friend so my brother has ditched me everyone <laughs> yeah i'm just walking home now and it's very warm and i'm wearing a jacket i've got a lot of work to do so i'm doing this 
Right, so I've just gotten in. I'm shopping here up because I am boiling. It's like really warm outside. So I'm very shiny currently, but I'm literally just about to edit tonight's video. Like I said, I'm running a bit behind schedule, but I think it should all be okay because it's literally just editing now. So this is my favorite part. Actually, let's turn that one off. I'm just watching um, Jade. Oh, you can't see. I'm watching Jade Bellington's vlogs because her videos are literally my favourite thing ever. So it's a lot later now, and after many hours of solid editing, I have literally like cram edited. I have my video up, and I was going to get it up tonight. It was all ready, um, but I haven't still haven't heard back from the Sailor representative as to whether they're happy for me to just. Um, put the video straight out public because sometimes when you do collaborations they um, like to see the video first like on unlisted just to make sure that you've sort of included everything that they wanted but I haven't heard back so I'm kind of I, I'm not sure I might either just put it up public and then if they want any changes to me just take it down and re-upload it or yeah but I'm very tempted just to put it up because I want to stick to my schedule since I've been doing very well with that and I'm currently just um killing time keep forgetting for like about I don't know like 30 minutes that results day is tomorrow and then it suddenly hits me and I'm like right <laughs> so I'm currently just window shopping online a bunch of clothes that um, I probably won't buy because I don't have that money I'm trying to save money for uni stuff but it's sort of um, keeping me distracted it's giving me something to do you'll probably see this vlog um, on results day on my results day anyway um, I know uh, here like the GCSE results date isn't until, I think it's a week tomorrow, it's exactly a week on Thursday because my brother gets his then, so um, I'm literally just nervously talking now, I, I'm a mess, I literally am such a wreck. <laughs> this could possibly be the worst ever angle that I have put you in, but um, my arm is getting very tired of holding you. So, plan for tomorrow morning is, um, I'm thinking I'm going to vlog it. Not necessarily vlog opening my results, obviously, but I was planning on vlogging tomorrow anyway because I think we are going out, um, I'm meeting my family tomorrow just because my like, my mum thought that it was good just to sort of keep me busy whether everything goes well or not. Um, so I was going to vlog anyway tomorrow. I'll probably end up just filming and then results come... I can get my results on my college website from 8am and also go on UCAS to check whether I've got into my uni or not. So I'm going to be up early, probably just going to film and then if it doesn't go well I'll just delete the footage, it's fine. <laughs> I don't know, I'm, I think it'll be okay, whatever happens it will be fine and yeah.